For the cheapest Xbox Live and PSN codes, go to g2a.com slash commensum. Use commensum for 3% off. And for the cheapest coins, go to gold.com. Links will be down in the description. And use customer rep Jonathan Black. Hello everyone, it is Commensum. And today we are back with another one of these squad builders. And this week we do have a Team of the Week hybrid squad builder. Featuring three players from this week's Team of the Week. If you didn't see yesterday's Championship Playoff squad, go check it out on my channel. And yeah... If you do want to see more squad builders like this, make sure you hit the subscribe button. So the first team of the week player we do have is uh, Daniel Carrico. Costs 11.5k, pretty decent stats actually. 85 defending, 86 physical and 71 pace for a uh, centre back which is pretty good. So the, the team around them is Diego Alves in goal, Jai Pereira, uh, Yardel in centre back. A bit slow but pretty strong. El Sao, Perez and then we do go on to our second team of the week player and it is Ezekiel Scarione uh, nice high low work rates pretty decent all round stats not fantastic but he is 11.25k and he is right at the bottom of his um, price cap at the minute and then we do have someone that fits in perfectly into this team is Castro getting chemistry well and then of course we do have right wing charisma 5 star skills and our third and final team of the week player is Freddy Montero 4 star skills 4 star weak foot um, 82 finishing, 82 dribbling and pretty decent physical as well and well okay physical and then left wing we do have another 5 star skiller which is Nani and we jump into a game here against a pretty strong team uh, got the likes of Di Maria, Fabregas, Sanchez, Sturridge, Griezmann, Cruz Cruz is one you're going to have to watch out for and then of course company and Courtois at the back and he does just send away Sanchez with a through ball but the keeper does make a good save. And that is probably one of the problems with this team uh, is the centre backs. Um, Daniel Carrico is very good at covering when he gets there. Doesn't have the best pace but Yardell is just too slow. They can just send three balls in behind especially in this game where he did have Sturridge, Sanchez and Griezmann. They were just able to get in behind Jardel. and if Carrico got back um, they had another player who was still quicker than Jardel to send away but as you can see Montero very very good dribbling was unfortunate with the final pass there <laughs> and Diego Alves makes a pretty good save I don't know what he was trying there going for the near post chip but he does pick up the corner and Cruz whips in a fantastic ball and he unfortunately gets one in off the post but there was a foul meaning that the goal did not count so you, you know, got away with that one. And this team overall is pretty good as you can see the front three make up very well whether you want to put them in a legal portuguese team you really could Montero the bow does struggle slightly with his finishing and um, nani charisma link up with them perfectly have that bit extra pace to get in behind the lines and then montero um isn't slow but his dribbling is fantastic and as you can see, we do rack up quite a few yellow cards in our midfield. One of them being Scarione, who I have to say is pretty good. His passing was very strong. And there we are unfortunate not to get a finish. But yeah, Scarione is pretty good actually. I would recommend them. So I would actually recommend trying out all these all three of these. Um all for under 15k. So very, very cheap in forms that you can pick up very easily there's lots of them on the market you're not going to have to sit there for hours uh, to get one but then Tony Cruz steps up for a free kick and in the way his free kicks are absolutely fantastic even though we put Nani back on the line he was not tall enough to clear that ball away so um, if you would like me to make another squad leave it in the comments down below what kind of team you would like me to make and I will get around right to doing that I do have a few more recorded, not quite edited yet, but yeah, do check out for those in the next few days, and you definitely will want to see them, so subscribe to the channel, and you will get the first um, chance to see them. So Charisma got in around the back, and did win a penalty there, Sergio Ramos did take him out, put him in his shirt, he did go down rather lightly, but you know we'll take the penalty, and Freddy Montero is going to step up to take it, and... Yeah, he is pretty good. His um, stats are very good. 82 power, 74 free kicker.
penalties, unfortunately. And um, this is how we lost it. You've never seen this video on my channel. I did put it up. Keeper makes a scene of it and it just bombs back. That's what we did.